You can take any white garbage bag and make it into an essential item that can be used by one and all. My name is Joanne Husband, and I'm here today to introduce you all to some of the hardest working ladies I've ever met. They are the Nanaimo Harbour City Crafty Workers, and they make a huge variety of things. I'm Terry Wolfarth, and we are the bag ladies, and starting making bags out of plastic bags. First of all, you get our bags, and you need to fold them up first to cut them to make your yarn. So you fold them like this, and then you fold it in half again, you fold it in half again, then we will cut off the top and cut off the seam at the bottom. I got the idea off the internet, some ladies in Australia started doing this and I thought it was a wonderful thing. And depending how thick you want your, your mat, you make wider strips. Then we take our strips and we join them together. Just loop them through and pull them tight so they make a nice, neat join. And then we just keep joining all these loops and we roll them into our ball, which is called plarn because it's plastic yarn. Then we start to crochet with them. We start with just a chain and we try to make them 36 to 42 inches wide. So it will be a sleeping mat, so wide enough for different sized people to, to sleep on. The bigger the crochet hook, the, the thicker the yarn, the, the, the wider the strips are, the thicker the yarn will be. So it'll make up a, a more cushioned mat. And with the finished one, we put We'll, we'll crochet a strap, just a chain on each end to make a strap so that we can roll them up, also crochet a handle on it. And then that way they can be rolled up, they can be slung over your thing and packed easily and they're very light, they're very warm, they'll keep you dry, they keep the, um, the warmth from, from, you know, if you're laying on ground or cement or whatever, they help keep you warm. So they would be great for the homeless, which is what we would like them for. So if people would like to learn how to do this, we would welcome anyone who would come and help make us mats for the homeless.